Hi there, I'm with Rory and uh, Gracie. Is that, did I pronounce that cor correctly? Uh, correct, Rory and Gracie. <laughs> I love it. Um, so tell me a little bit about the Gracie diet because I've heard a little bit about it and um, I understand it's about, is it about limiting the amount of hours you actually eat? Um, yes, the idea is uh, my uncle spent 65 years studying food combining yeah. with the objective of keeping the Gracie family healthy so that we could uphold the Gracie challenge. And on that note, he figured that there are some foods that should be mixed together yeah. and some foods should not be mixed together. And because of that, the trick is how to learn how to combine these foods properly. So after 65 years of research, he put together a concept of how you should mix these elements at each meal. And that's what the Gracie Diet book is about. Sh shows you how to properly combine everything. And that's what people should look into. So, uh, I, what, what shouldn't I combine? Like, what's the worst thing to combine when, with food? For example, one should not eat dessert. Every time you eat cooked food, yeah. let's go this way a little bit. Every time you cook, eat cooked food, you should not eat sweets. Okay. Fat and sweets are not a good combination. So the idea of eating dessert, it's not healthy for you. It might yeah. taste good, but it's not healthy for you. Fat and sugar taste the best together. <laughs> 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 like donuts. Yeah, well, stuff like that, like I said, it might taste good, but it's ultimately yeah. going to help you dig your grave. So yeah. the idea is to eat properly so that you eat only the things that are healthy for you. And unless people are taught how to eat right, yeah. it's going to be very confusing because the advertisement and commercials of all different kinds of foods and stuff like that encourage you to be eating the junk food. So it's, a, it's, a, it's you know something that you have to keep in mind. So I was following a, raw, a pretty strict raw diet for a while, and are you um, are you on like do you prefer cooked food or raw food, or is there a difference to you? You can actually eat anything you want. The idea is how to mix your foods at each meal. Yeah. That's the concept. So, for example, for breakfast, I will make a cantaloupe juice, fresh squeezed cantaloupe juice, blended with a half a dozen bananas, for example. Uh -huh. Okay, that's breakfast, kind of a, a little bit over, almost a blender full of that. And then for lunch, I'll have some kind of protein, maybe fish, uh, either pasta or rice, you know what I'm saying, or potatoes. You should not mix two starches on the same meal. And then you have uh, vegetables and salads and that kind of stuff. No dessert. No dessert. No dessert. And then for dinner, five hours later, I'll have some watermelon juice, uh, maybe a little bit of uh, cheese, small, you know, fresh cheese. And then I'll have some dates and some rye crackers or something like that, and that's that's the day. Three meals a day. That's the basic concept. You should want you to have three meals a day, and make sure you space your meals at least four and a half to five hours apart. Number one. Number two, fat and sugar should not be mixed at the same meal. And you should have one starch per meal. One starch. Either bread or potato or rice. You know what I'm saying? Or quinoa, but not two starch on the same meal. The idea of rice and beans or bread and potatoes are best, not good for your health. Are you going to uh, watch the McGregor fight? The what? Are you going to watch the McGregor fight? Um, actually, not really because, <laughs> you know, since I sold the UFC, yeah. it's like the things have changed so much, the rules are different, and today's a boxing match. It's, just, yeah. it's not, yeah, it doesn't really Not matter. the same thing. Not the same thing. Well, cool. Well, thank you so much for taking the time and telling us a little bit about the Gracie diet. You're very welcome. Anyone who has more information should follow me on Facebook, Body on Gracie. I'm always giving tips on how to combine your foods properly. So yeah, is that the best place to find you on Facebook, or do you have an Instagram as well? Oh uh, yeah, Instagram as well, Body on Gracie, Facebook, Twitter, all those. Great. Thank you thank so you much. Very much.